Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel where it's my opinion or no opinion at all. Scott Delicious McFabulous here and I hope that you are feeling Percy. And today I hope you're feeling honey and crisp because Kate Spade Outlet has released some honey crisp apples in handbags and handbag styles. But before we hop into today's shopping vlog to Kate Spade Outlet for Honey Crisp Apples, if you guys love handbags, hauls, Kate Spade Outlet, the whole lot of those, please hit the subscribe button if you are new. And if you guys enjoy today's content, make sure you hit that like button as it does help me know you enjoy today's video and it helps with that pesky YouTube Al Go Rhythm. Is something wrong? No, nothing. Splendid, shall we? Let's dive right into this honey crisp goodness. And for the first handbag on the chopping block for today's shopping vlog is the Audrey Apple Flap Crossbody Bag, $529 before the discount, which is 40% off. These are brand new bags, so they are going to be a bit like a lot more expensive than the rest of the store, but I'm really vibing with this collection. I love apples and I feel like the embroidery and the fabrics used for these handbag lines, they're actually pretty good. They don't, they didn't really feel that cheap to me. And I love the apple embroidery. Like the apples are just so cute. After that is the Honey Crisp Apple Coin Purse Bag Charm. I'm completely obsessed. We know I love my quilts. I love quilted anything. It's honestly just a vibe. But this green color, I've been looking at this green color for a while. $169, by the way. And I really want it in a handbag. But, like, seeing it in this, like, I'm loving it. I'm completely in love. Just open it up. And you can totally tell that it has just enough room for some AirPods and like little extra things like that. So it's not some bag charm or coin purse that's not going to hold much. It's going to hold something at least. And after that is the Ella Apple tote bag for $509. Looking very nice. As you can see, there's some really fancy like uh, threading and stitching on the handles. And I like that. But open it up here and you got the Kate Spade, a little tag on the inside. Not too bad. I really enjoy the bag charm on top of the bag itself. Like, it's so sick. And the bag charm would look so good on my Prada vintage bag there. And with my outfit. Like, I'm just telling you guys, like, I was seething. And talking about seething, the Honeycrisp Apple Cross a Body Bag. I'm in love, except for except for the dirt on there, but I'm in love. I am absolutely in love. $479, 40% off, really not that bad, but I love this piece. This piece is so sickening. I just love the color. I love that it's quilted. It gives me like poison apple vibes almost. Like, I've been saying this a lot, but like, Acid green, eat your heart out, like acid dream. I love it. It would it would if it looked so good with the outfit I was wearing. I'm just like, oh, can I just walk out of the store with this, please? <laughs> Very beautiful. What's not so beautiful is me struggling trying to one hand these handbags. But I'm a pro. Well, becoming one. <laughs> Just get a quick look with the green apple. As you can see, it literally perfectly matches my top. And it would look so cute. It is a total, it's a totally different vibe than my Prada bag with like the outfit I'm wearing right there. But 
with if I swapped out the Prada bag and swept or swapped around a couple things, like that would look completely drop dead gorgeous. Next up is the Stacy Large Red Apple Continental Wallet. A nice big wallet. I'm not too much of a fan of this print per se. Like, I like how there's like some like uh, gradient or not gradient, but like an ombre type of color blocking effect. $289. So for me, it's a little bit expensive for like a wallet from Kate Spade Outlet. But these were pretty nice pieces. Like the Safiano leathers and such, they didn't feel very cheap. This piece here is the Stacy Large White Apple Compartment Bifold Wallet. Here's a really beautiful mini camera bag in like a Safiano leather. I actually was trying to bite myself not to walk out of the store with this. I really love the purple. The purple is sickening. Like we know I'm not much of a fan of like a camera bag and such, but I really like the purple. Like, there's actually quite a few things in this shopping vlog that I would actually want to get. And it's actually kind of surprising, actually. Then they also had the, like, apple print, the red apple print on the mini hammer bags. Looks very nice as well. Definitely vibing the purple. <laughs> the purple is definitely my favorite. And here is the Stacy Small Satchel. These pieces here, like anything in the front with the mini camera bags and such, $459. But everything here was 60% off plus an additional 20% off. So they were, they were really good deals. And this piece, the Stacy Small Satchel in the purple, this was... Like, between that and the mini camera bag, I was really trying hard not to, like, walk out of the store. Because, like, they were just so adorable. I, I Like, the color is just screaming to me. $459, like the black. But I'm, I'm just in love with the purple. The purple, for me, is what does it. After the beautiful purple piece, we got the Honeycrisp Sliced Apple Coin Purse. Also, so cute. I definitely like the quilted a little better, but this still adds such a beautiful edge to like any type of summer handbag that I wouldn't even mind having it. Next up is this really pretty, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say it, it reminds me of like an Asian aesthetic, like Asian kitchen aesthetic, like chopping apples. I don't know why, but it definitely does. And it's gorgeous. It is so beautiful. I love the mixture of colors, $129. I'm not sure how much percentage off was with this scarf specifically, but I really liked it. Get some good lighting on some more of the random goodies throughout the store. And they had this really nice mannequin all dressed up in all of the pretty apple prints and embroidered pieces. And the apple of my eye pendant. This is so beautiful. This is so beautiful. And before moving on to the apple of my eye jewelry set, this is the one tote bag. I couldn't find the name for this online. So sadly, there won't be a link for it. But I thought I would show it off anyways but the construction was nice it was just like your average tote bag i can't remember the leather used i think it was like a between like cross grain or safiano but it was still pretty good and i don't think it was too expensive i can't remember if it was 40 percent off or something higher but regardless it looks pretty good yeah i think that's a cross grain leather now let's move on to this beautiful jewelry. Who here has ever bought Kate Spade jewelry? Because I need to know. I desperately need to know. I was having troubles not trying to buy this entire jewelry line. Like the bracelet and the, um, the pendant. Like it is so beautiful. All of these pieces are so bright and gorgeous. I don't know how well they would hold up. They do say it's gold-plated, but 
when I asked the manager at the store, they had absolutely no clue what it was made with or anything. So if anybody has any idea what Kate Spade outlet jewelry is like, please let me know. Is it worth like $40 for this little pendant? Even if I removed the chain, if it's too cheap and put it on like a more expensive chain, is it worth doing so? Please let me know. I would really appreciate it because like these are really pretty and I don't want to waste money on something that's going to fall apart or tarnish. Maybe there is right now. And 99 don't believe in you. But all you need is just for one person to believe. There can be a hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred, hundred people, hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred, 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 or a thousand, nine thousand. Or nine nine hundred ninety nine. There can be a. Alrighty, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed today's Honey Crisp Apple Kate Spade Outlet Shop with me. What was your favorite piece? Because girl, there's a couple pieces. A couple pieces I would actually really like to get. And that quilted apple. That quilted apple. Either it be the bag or the bag charm, girl. I would love to get that. I would love to get that. Don't be surprised. What was your favorite piece? But anyways, if you guys did enjoy today's shop with me at Kate Spade Outlet, please hit the subscribe button if you are new. Hit that like button, share with your friends and family, comment to me any type of opinion you may or may not have had on today's video or outfit of the day. As well, you can always support me and the channel further by sending me a super thanks, and you can always check out the description box below for the three lucky links to my Instagram, Facebook, and Discord notification squad. I love you all to the absolute moon and back, and I'll see you all in mine next video. Bye! <laughs> I think it was good. I don't, I don't. I'm done. I'm done. No, no. Show's <laughs> over. Show's <laughs> over. <laughs>